Hey everybody, this is Corn Smith from TechTyro, and today I'll be doing a tutorial on how to make a basic vase in Blender. So when we open it up, we have the default cube. We're just going to delete that and hit Shift A to make a new object, and we're going to do a circle. And so as you can see, it's just the plain ring around there right now. Um, if we hit Tab, we'll go into Edit Mode, and you press F, and it just puts a face on that. Um, so basically this will be the base of our vase. I'm just going to stale it down a little bit. And so here's our base. Um, I'm going to work from orthographic view. So we're going to hit 5. And then I'm just going to work from the front on. So we're just going to hit 1. And bring it down to the ground plane. Alright, so we're ready to start making a vase. Um, so basically, I'm just going to go and with the face selected as you can see I'm going to hit E for extrude and we're just going to scale it out to get our basic vase shape alright so we're out at the top now and with most vases um, there's a rounded top um, so we're just going to go, and I like to zoom in on this when I'm working here. So we're going to go extrude up one more, and we'll scale it in a bit. Extrude, scale, and we're at the top now. So we're going to extrude and right click so it goes back to where it was. And we're just going to scale that in. And we'll do that again. So extrude up, right click, scale it in. And since now we're going down on the lip, we're going to bring this side down and do that again. Extrude, right click, S for scale, and down once more. And that looks like the lip. So we'll have our lip done there. And so now we have to go back and model the inside of it. So we're going to go back and hit 1 to face the front. And we're going to, get, when we're going to hit a Z or wireframe. Uh, yes, I say Z like a Canadian. Uh, so we're going to zoom in. And we're just going to follow what we had before for our mesh. So we'll extrude down and scale it in. And extrude down. And extrude. Scale it out. And basically, I'm just following the second line here. It's going to be a bit of a thicker vase. Alright, and so we're just going to close it off a bit by making it nice and small at the base. Let's extrude it down a bit more. And if we hit Z, and go back out, we'll hit Tab to go into Object Mode. And as you can see, it's you can see all the faces on it. And vases don't have faces like that. So we need to uh, smooth that out a bit. So if you go up to Shading here, and you hit Smooth, so you have a nice smooth vase now for flowers to get put in and all that fun stuff. And you also notice, if you zoom in, that we have an interior for this. So now it's a full 3D vase with stuff you can put inside or fracture. Um, in our next two tutorials, Keith will be applying a mat to this. And he will also be doing a fracture for it, uh, to fracture it. Um, as always, check out our other tutorials at techtower.com. Uh, thank you for watching this, and Korn, signing out.